Hey everybody. So as you know, my name is Keonti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. Let's go ahead, jump right into this reading. Let us see what the messages are that Spirit has here for you on today. Please do keep in mind you all, these are general messages to so only take what resonates with you and leave the rest, all right? We have an emperor once in union here wanting to put the work in, okay? Let us see. Oh, okay. We have the sun card. So the both of you are very happy with each other right now. The both of you feel like this could be a very successful relationship. You're open with them. They're open with you. You feel very truthful and honest. Okay. Or you feel very truthful and honest energy coming from them. And they feel the same coming from you. Very straightforward and direct. Okay. This could be the most open you've been with somebody. Hence why that truthful and honest energy comes up. We have the death card. Okay. Huge transformation about to take place here. Okay. I feel like either you've been having some health issues or your person was having some health issues. Health is improving because I saw temperance, the sun and death, a lot of help there in that energy okay so i feel like where your head is you want to see things move forward you want to let go of whatever is from the past okay i feel like this is something you really want to stand up and fight for you want this connection to work out you're determined to see something happen here with this person okay there could be outside interference or people that are attempting to stand in the way okay you may also be coming across to this person like you have other options or people that are interested in you all right, but out of nowhere, something shifts, something changes with this tower, okay? Sudden happenings, okay? If you feel like things have been taken a while, it could be for a reason. Your person could have invested themselves into some not so great things, not so great people, and those things had to fall away organically. I feel like they are. Yeah, Six of Wands is overcoming the obstacles and overcoming the challenges, okay? So let's see what's going on with your person. Oop, the star card. They feel like this is a faded connection this is something that's meant to be for you to have the sun and then the star yeah they feel like this is a destined connection three of pentacles is about commitment person wants to commit themselves to you okay let us see this could have been someone that never wanted commitment before never wanted a committed relationship you know then meet you and they like four of pentacles like this is something i have to hold on to i don't want to let this person go the hierophant yeah this person that admires your loyalty the queen of wands yeah, both of these um, energies represent loyalty. So they admire your loyalty, okay? They want to hold on to it. It's something they don't want to lose, okay? They truly favor that, okay? Let us see. We have the Two of Cups. This person is in love. They are in love, okay? And they think all the time about who else could feel this way towards you or who else has feelings for you or something like that. Person has been lied to a lot, but they can't help but notice you give them the truth, whether it's something they're going to like or they're not going to like. This is your divine masculine showing up as the emperor here, and we have a six of swords. There's space and distance between you and this person, so this could be a literal space and distance. Like, this could be a long-distance situation. But yeah, in the past, this person was lied to a lot. They were let down a lot, as were you. This person is not here for that, okay? They're not here for the game. That's not what I'm saying. Person knows exactly what they want and who they want it with. They're very attracted to you, your independence, okay? They see you as a very prosperous energy, all right? Somebody who has been rewarded from spirit, you know, for the hard work they put in in life, okay? They feel like you're very mature. You're somebody full of wisdom and grace, the way you carry yourself. King of Wands to that Queen of Wands. You just like they love your energy. They feel like you're loyal. Your vibration is super high all the time. You always have very positive energy or positive things to say. You're very honest and truthful. Like I said, they've been lied to and deceived a lot. So you're like a breath of fresh air. You know, this person just wants to do right by you. Okay. This person could be somebody that works in the legal system or somebody that has a lot of stuff going on right now with the legal system. Okay. With the law. Okay, let us see. But this person is determined to stand up and fight for this connection, as are you. They don't want to lose you. You don't want to lose them. It's something worth holding on to, the both of you feel. You've been investing your time, your energy, your effort into this connection because you want to see it grow into something else. Okay, but like this person has something they want you to know. Hmm. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio, Leo, Taurus, Aquarius, Virgo. Gemini, Cancer, Capricorn, okay, Sagittarius, <clears throat> but yeah, whatever this person wants to talk to you about, they want to talk to you about it because they're stressing and they feel like you always know what to do, okay, you always know what to do or you always know how to get something done, 
Okay, again, the Queen of Wands is what you showed up initially as. Queen of Wands is um, very business minded, okay, very goal oriented, very driven. All of these are wands. So when it comes to what action to take, they feel like you would know what to do with the Five of Wands and the Seven of Wands here, especially. It's something that this person is going through, something that they're attempting to end, but it's not the easiest thing, okay? This could be something that is turning into a disaster, but they feel like if you, you give them the appropriate advice, they'll be able to handle it a lot better or something like that it could be something that you have experience with the nine of pentacles is a single parent as well okay so any event that your person has to break something off with somebody that they done had a child or children with you know without causing too much of a fuss or whatever that may be something they want your advice on Okay, like how did you do it? How did you break off with such and such? You know, that's another thing. I never understood 555 on a timestamp. That's confirmation about the tower. I never understood how people just use that as an excuse to keep going back to somebody that's not good for you. Okay, you have child or children together. Okay. I feel like you're better off in a healthier environment and so is the child because when you're your best self you can give that to the child if you all tired and beat up and stressed out how are you giving that to the child I mean what do you even have to give to them you know so that could be the kind of advice that they're looking for like how did you leave that person alone or how did you end things with that person or something like that okay we have the ace of cups here we have the three of cups so there's a reason why there's been a pause okay this person has whatever they got going on they need to wrap up it has nothing to do with them not wanting to be with you okay that's not gonna resonate with everybody but there's something that that person needs to handle and they want you to know about it okay a lot of you already do know about it like i said a person has been an open book with you they've been telling you pretty much everything that's going on we got the six of pentacles okay six of pentacles is about reciprocity okay they feel like you give they give okay you're not sitting up there with your hand out they ain't sitting up there with their hand out both parties want to know how they can contribute to the well-being of the other one not how they can take something away from okay person can't stop thinking about you and they always want to talk to you okay so let's say this person gets good news they want to share it with you they get bad news they want to share it with you this person is always wanting to talk to you always wanting to fill you in on what's going on all right the three of wands is a future this person can see themselves having a future with you page of cups okay person feels like they are falling in love okay queen of swords they appreciate your mind and how sharp it is they're coming up with a plan as to how they can make this official okay we got the knight of pentacles and the knight of cups they're coming up with a plan as to how they can make this official how they can make this something that is a part of their everyday life okay what is the underlining here the two of wands that's a decision they've made they can't stop thinking about it so they feel like may as well be with the person i can't stop thinking about okay yeah this person could have been stuck on a hamster wheel and pretending that everything was okay but a lot of you knew that they were going through something behind closed doors they just weren't sharing it with you they didn't want to turn you off okay they didn't want you to look at them sideways or whatever okay so they just made it seem like everything was perfectly fine even though it's not or something okay let us see thank you spirit where are the messages Okay, we have drama queen yeah they're you're like a breath of fresh air compared to what they're used to this is why they love you and they know they love you for certain they're like wow this is different you know than what i'm used to totally different yeah okay you give them a clear energy okay they're cleansing their energy right now some of you may have noticed a little bit of space and distance between the two of you could be because of this this person feels like they have some stuff going on that they gotta sort out and in the event they do not, then that energy will come over to you and they don't want that. Okay. What is this? We got the, yep, receipts, proof. They do have the proof, okay? A lot of you are like, let me know when you're done with Carmen. Go, they're done. They're going to let you know. Didn't I say they had some stuff going on? Chow, alimony, government, okay? Lock, box, closing, trap, frustrated, rescue, others involved. Yeah, okay? So they want to talk to you about these things, okay? We have the tower. Hmm. somebody here has been afraid of judgment okay like what you're going to say and this is today in this present moment we've got settlement okay so something has happened suddenly out of nowhere and now that it has it's like they can't take their focus off of you they can't take their eyes off of you all right they're anxious about how you're going to react to this because you make them really happy all right and they feel like they can never get enough of the love that you offer 
They don't want this to be done. They want to take a risk and come towards you. But like I said, they had to clear certain energies out first. Okay, so may not sound like the person was telling you the truth, but they are. We have pause. Yeah, seven of pentacles. I've invested my time, my energy. Where's the results? Tick tock, tick tock. But it's like it's a matter of divine timing. Not necessarily right now because we want it. You know, the offer will be put on the table. Proposal, commitment. Like I said, person wants to be with you. All right. But they don't want you to run away from them or avoid them or discard this. <clears throat> Due to them being stuck on hamster wheel, handling whatever that situation is. Okay. These cards stay behind. Let me see what it is. <clears throat> Hold on, y'all. Let me fix this. Okay. Yeah, they're sending you telepathic communication. They can't stay away from you. They're coming back in the very near future. That's why it fell out over this. Three of Wands. Okay, something has to come towards you. Something that is to happen. Okay, the meeting. Two or more people, discussions and planning. Okay, like I said, they want to meet. They want to see you. They want to talk. They want to let you know what's been going on. This roller coaster ride that they've been on. Okay, why they had to keep everything so quiet and private and all of that. Okay. They're going to be very open and honest with you. Remember, not every reading is for everybody. Take what resonates with you. Leave what doesn't. All right. Person may feel like they have to beg for something. Beg for somebody to work with them or to be fair or something. Somebody could have been trying to stand in the way of this person coming towards you. But it could be this person. Go figure. Right. But this person is not. They're not interested in allowing this person to dictate their happiness. So they're going to come to you. Let you know what's been going on. Let you know why it comes across like they've been deceiving you or why they've been um, sabotaging the connection. Okay, because of this drama queen. Okay, let's see. Yeah, definitely. Somebody that they had something going on with where they created a family could also be someone that, you know, is a part of their inner circle and they have a lot of the same friends and just different things like that. Okay, person felt like they were trapped for a minute. Because of somebody that they are not even dealing with anymore. Like that. Okay. Let us see here. Ciao. We got locked down. Okay. Yeah. Mental prison confined. I want to be with my happiness. But I feel like my happiness thinks I'm pushing my emotions away because of this situation. And maybe I should just tell you what's been going on. You know, karmic, financial support, legal. See what I'm saying? Maybe I should just tell you what's going on so you don't think I don't love you. Okay, but again, they were embarrassed about what you would think. Person feels like there's something special between the two of you, and it is. This is your twin. Okay, this is your twin. Yeah, there's a reason why they wanted to keep everything on a DL. It's not because they didn't love you. It's not because they weren't interested. They know you're their divine feminine. All right, they know you're their soulmate. Even if they don't know what a twin flame is, honey. But they were protecting you from these toxic people, these toxic situations. Okay, that five of wands energy. All right. Yeah. Denial. So you may have felt like they were denying you or like they were pushing you away. No, they were embarrassed about what was happening. They were embarrassed. They didn't want to turn you off. OK, they were being open and honest about their feelings. They just weren't speaking up on this situation. It's embarrassing. OK, it's embarrassing. That's how they feel. OK, they don't want you to cut them off, though, because it is. And they didn't want the person to cut their communication off with child or children. I feel like it was something connected to that. I said that earlier, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, Drama Queen wanted to try to intervene with their connection. So they didn't want to do anything that would have that happen. Okay. So, yeah, they want to talk to you. They want you to understand very well what's going on. Okay. So you can stop running from them. Child, person has access to you, whether you realize it or not. They're watching you in some way, and they're ready to come towards you and take this risk. Yeah, they was trying to protect you from the pettiness, the jealousy, and the envy. Okay, that's this poisonous energy. They're hoping and praying that they haven't run out of time. They're online searching for you. Some of you may have blocked this person already, but you can't stop thinking about them, and they can't stop thinking about you. Ciao. All right, so I pray that this helps you. I know that it will. If this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hair.